Hello everyone, um, my name is Nikki and this is my first YouTube video and I'm so excited about it. Uh, I love YouTube, I watch YouTube probably way more than I need to, but who doesn't? Um, so I am very excited to be making a video of my own, even just like recording right now, it's like, ooh, look at me, I'm a YouTuber. <laughs> like when can I start calling myself a YouTuber? Like once this video is up? I'm gonna do it. Um, but anyways, I am, I love YouTube because it's such a variety. Um, you can post about anything. So I do plan on doing that. Um, I have a lot going on right now. Um, I'll have a lot going on for the rest of the year. Um, but for example, things I do plan on posting, I do have an eight week old baby. Uh, her name is Zaya. And me and my husband, we live in SoCal right now. Um, and right now we're just pretty much focused on taking care of her and just really enjoying these first months. And it has been a handful. It's been also really beautiful and crazy. Just having a baby is something that you really can't prepare for at all. And it's, it's been an experience and I've been learning. I think I'm doing my best and that's what matters. Um, so you'll be seeing some content on her her milestones. Um, we're gonna be moving soon right now. We're living in Southern California. We'll be moving in just like soon. Uh, so I'll take you guys on that journey as well. I plan to get new furniture. Um, all of the stuff I got for her nursery, I didn't hang anything up. I just kind of left it because I knew we were gonna be moving and I didn't want to poke a bunch of holes in the wall because like I'm gonna have to fix them before I leave. So scratch that i'm just waiting until we move so i have a bunch of things for her nursery that have not been put together even her crib like she sleeps in her bassinet right now and her crib is just sitting in the box still it's it's so sad but we'll be moving soon and you guys will see a nursery tour or you know you'll see me hook her nursery up basically um so that's exciting and just the whole moving process like i want a new couch i want a new bed frame my husband probably wants a new TV, so we'll be <laughs> having some excitement in regards to like home decor and things like that. So if you're into that, there'll be some content for you. Um, I'm also um, a registered nurse. I just graduated actually December 2019. I was super pregnant when I finished nursing school, so I didn't uh, apply anywhere because like I was pregnant and the baby was coming there was no point I'm moving it would have been silly to try to even apply um, and work somewhere so that'll be interesting I'm very uh, excited to to start applying um, I'm not sure how like the interview processes are gonna be going during COVID-19 but um, I'll be sure to share my experiences with uh, my fellow nurses here on YouTube or people that are interested on how that's going um, so that'll be exciting I love healthcare. I've been in healthcare for 10 years. I know I am older than I look, but don't play me, I'm not that old. Um, but I've been in healthcare for 10 years, uh, direct patient care. I love patients, I love helping people, love taking care of people. Um, always something new, they keep you on your toes. Um, your brain is always working and it's, it's a beautiful thing and I love it. I will probably be in healthcare for the rest of my life, among other things that I plan to do, but um, something that I want to do forever is definitely just take care of people. So that's um, definitely going to have some content on nursing as well. Sharing NCLEX tips. Uh, I only took it once. Thank goodness. I swear I failed, but I passed. Thank goodness. Um, so I can share some tips on how I studied. Also um, tips on nursing school. I feel like I thrived so much in nursing school. Um, before nursing school, I mean, yeah, obviously you had to do prerequisites for school and high school and blah, blah, blah. But I didn't care as much about those classes. And once I got into nursing, the once I got into the nursing program, I thrived. I was in a room full of people that loved healthcare. I was with uh, being taught by teachers who loved teaching about healthcare and patients. And I was at great hospitals doing clinicals and guy, it was so fun. And I will also share some tips on um, how to be the best nursing student you can at the clinicals um, because I felt like I was a rock star among many of my classmates. We, we, we did really well. I feel like our school really prepared us for clinicals. 
I don't know about the real world, but I can get you through clinicals at least for now until I actually get my own job. Um, but it's great. I mean, I can show you guys how to prepare. So again, fellow nurses, there's some content on here for you as well. So right now we got baby stuff. I'm going to talk about postpartum stuff because that shit was crazy. Um, and I'm just now starting to feel better talk about nursing, we're gonna talk about home decor, um, just a little bit of everything. And like I said, I'm excited if you can tell. I'm also kind of nervous because like, I don't know, I'm just talking in front of the camera and I'm not used to this. Uh, so it'll be, it'll be an adjustment. Let's just say that. So wish me luck, you guys. Please subscribe, there's a no harm, it's free. Like just subscribe to my channel. And if I absolutely freaking disappoint you, then delete me, never think about me, no hard feelings, we'll cut the tie, but it is worth a try. Please just subscribe and we'll see how it goes. Thank you if you're even watching this video. Thanks for watching. If you make it till the end, go you, you know, you are amazing for watching this. Um, so stay tuned for whatever the hell I bring to this YouTube channel. Um, I will try not to disappoint. So thank you so much. You guys have a beautiful day. Stay safe and I'll see y'all soon. Bye. Hello. <laughs> Hello everyone.